Hey, it's Abby and I'm back in our kitchen today talking about our organized coffee station and our organized smoothie station. So I realize it hasn't been that long since I reorganized our kitchen, but as we've lived with it longer, I realize that there are some changes that could be made to make it even more functional. I'm excited to be partnering with Inner Design for today's video. I've used their bins and products before in places like our organized junk drawer and in our refrigerator. And you're going to see how their bins and organizers have helped us make our space even more effective and functional. You've probably seen Inner Design's bins and organizational accessories at places like the Container Store, Target, Walmart, Bed Bath & Beyond, and there are also a ton of them on Amazon. So those are some great places to look for them. So first, let me show you how we reorganized our coffee station. So if you remember from our kitchen tour, our Keurig used to be over next to the refrigerator, but I realized we were always filling it up with water from the sink, so it made more sense for it to be on this side of the kitchen. I keep a few basic things that we use all the time on the counter, but mostly everything is tucked away in a cabinet so we can keep our counters pretty clear. So other than the Keurig, I have these three small food storage bottles from Inner Design that we're using to hold creamer, sugar, and marshmallows that the boys like to use for their hot chocolate. I will link to these and all of the other products that I mentioned below in the description. So if you're looking for any of them, you will find direct links there. If you've watched my channel for any amount of time, you know I'm a little bit obsessed with labeling. So I used my Silhouette machine and some adhesive vinyl to label each of the bottles so we can clearly see what's in each one. If you have questions about how I do my labeling, I actually made a video all about it so I can link to that in the description as well. Let's take a look inside the cabinet. On the first shelf of the cabinet, we are using Inner Design stacking organizer bins to hold all of our K-cups. What I love about these bins is that they allow me to really maximize the space on this shelf and I can separate the different types of K-cups that we have. I used to have a little holder on our counter that would hold our K-cups, but when Donnie started really liking these softer K-cups for his coffee, that bin didn't really work anymore. So this was the perfect solution. These bins are really flexible. They can hold the traditional K-cups or the softer kind, and they keep everything neat and separated. So we have our hot chocolate, our tea, our coffee, and you know where to go and get each type. Again, everything is labeled with the vinyl labels. Our second shelf holds our coffee mugs. And again, to maximize the space, we used a little riser. This is the Inner Design Cabinet Bin Stackable Shelf, and it allowed us to fit two rows of mugs neatly in the cabinet rather than just the one or trying to pile them on top of each other and risk them getting broken or something like that. The third shelf holds our travel mugs, so they're easy to grab. And then up at the top is all of our coffee supplies that we use with a more traditional coffee maker. We mostly use the Keurig for everything, but we do have a traditional coffee maker tucked up in one of our high cabinets that we mostly use when guests come over. I've used some Inner Design Linus Vanity Organizer bins to make it easy to pull down what we need from that top shelf. Anytime we're having guests, we can easily see what's in them and we can grab what we need very quickly. So this cabinet ended up being perfect for all of our coffee supplies, but I had to find somewhere else to put all of our items that we needed to use to make our smoothies. So let's take a look at what we did with those. For our smoothie station, I use a tray to corral our toaster and magic bullet. This makes them easy to tuck away out of sight if we don't want them cluttering up the counter. And if we open up this cabinet, we kept the first shelf the same. It still holds all of our basic glasses, but then I was able to use the entire second shelf for smoothie and shake supplies. Our boys really like to use straws, so we have a whole bin of those for them. This is actually an organizer from Inner Design that is meant for hair accessories, but it worked perfectly to hold all of our straws in this cabinet as well. I then used a small stacking bin to hold the cup rims, and if I got more cup rims at any time, I could always add another layer and stack it on top if I need to, so they're really versatile. I then used an Inner Design Clarity Kitchen Drawer Organizer to corral the blades, just to keep them all in line here. And then the cups and magic bullet accessories are organized by type on the rest of the shelf. The actual powders that I use for our shakes and smoothies are in this drawer down here. I was able to find these pantry food storage bins with this hinge lid that are airtight. They are from Inner Design as well. And then I just labeled the top with what type of powder is inside each one. 
This makes it really easy to just pull out what we need and then put it right back and keep it neat and tidy. These are also stackable. So if you'd wanna use them in a pantry or in a cabinet where you could stack them a few high, that would work as well. We've been using this setup for a few weeks now and it's worked really well for us. I love how well everything functions and how beautiful it looks every time I open one of the cabinets or the drawers. You can find links to all of the products that we use for our organization project in the description below, or you can search Amazon or Target, Walmart, Bed Bath & Beyond, or the Container Store for other inner design products to help you to organize your kitchen or anywhere else in your house. Before you head out, be sure to subscribe so you don't miss any organization inspiration, and let me know in the comments which bins you think would be the most helpful to help you organize your kitchen.